YouTube, it's Weasel from We Play. But wait a minute, let's try that again. Hello, YouTube, it's Weasel from We Play Badly. I'm playing Fallout 4. As soon as I click the right button, hello, right button, as opposed to left button. So last week was a bit rough for me. For those of you who may have seen my uh, attempt at a New Vegas stream, I had to stop early because I had, um, of all things, strep throat. Now you're probably thinking, Weasel, you're 46 year old. How do you get a disease that only affects children? An excellent question to which I have an excellent answer. I vacuumed my floor, kicked something up into the air. I vacuumed my room. It needed it because it hadn't been done in a while. Excuse me. I kicked something into the air that the that my body did not like. It triggered a bacteriological infectio infectious response and voila, strep throat. Something that the last time I recall having it, I was 13. And you want to know why adults are having childhood diseases? I'll give you an answer. What starts with C has Ovid in the middle and ends with dash 19. It's not real, you're just imagining things. Explain that to my fucking strep throat, you buttholes. Take your medications and get vaccinated. Don't be stupid. Anyway, here we go. Oh yeah, would you like to see the size of the pill I'm taking right now? Here, let me show you, let me show you. Check it out, check it out. See that? See that? Pretty big, huh? Let me give you a better example of how big it is. That's my mouth, right there. That's the pill. Doesn't look like much. Till you oh, here, better example. Um. We're waiting for me to, you know, actually take my medication. Um. Here, better example. This is an Advil gel, gel cap I take when I'm in pain. It's a rarely happening thing, right? This is the pill they wanted me to swallow when half my throat was swollen shut. Swollen shut. Do you see the difference? Hey, you want me to do what with that? <laughs> Good luck. Anyway, down the hatch. <clears throat> By the way, yes, I hate swallowing pills. I used to not care, and then something happened. Somewhere along the way, I did... Somewhere along this, the way, I developed this horrifically terrible thing called a gag reflex. Now, some people might think it's funny that I say that, but the truth is, it really sucks when someone's trying to check your tonsils. <laughs> Somebody is attempting to make something resembling a baked good, and I can smell it from wherever they are. <clears throat> Anywho, I should probably actually start the game. Let's start the game. <clears throat> I played a whopping one hour. But it's the best hour, because it's the hour you don't have to see me playing with my facial structures going, does that look like me? Does that look like me? That's not my face. I'm, am I that ugly? Do I really look like that? And the answer is yes. Yes, you do. Um, but you also have serious body image issues, so we're just gonna, we're just gonna go with it because I'm not fighting with you anymore, me. All right, let's activate the door controls. <coughs> God, that pit boy looks ridiculous. Vault door cycling sequence initiated. Please stand back. <clears throat> <clears throat> 
Man, it would really suck if the door, the, the swinging, thing, swinging part got stuck. Oh, of course, and if you're on Twitch, now it's going to start in approximately one minute. Yay! That is a big... That is a damn big door. God, so many ways that things could have, the thing could have broken. <coughs> uh, hello? Oh, I was expecting to let that actually open. Uh, whatever. Oh, stairs. Okay, by the way, that is the best I could do for my face. And if you notice that he's a little bit uh, tubby in the middle, so am I. Deal with it. Is he kind of buff? Well, I work in a warehouse, so am I. Again, deal with it. Let's look at the face one more time. Look, I'm not a facial software expert. It's the best I can do, and he looks much better from a distance. But you know what? I would like to look a little less tubby, you know, because I could look super tubby, or I could be... The problem is, is I'm, like, smack dab in the middle, and I hate being smack dab in the middle of anything. So let's just go super buff. Because I'm going to have to be super buff for the stupidity I'm going to get myself into. <clears throat> Return to the surface, and thank you for choosing Vault Tech. Sucker. <coughs> In fact, almost every vault was actually a secret social experiment conducted by Vault Tech. Why? <coughs> you know what you could have done instead, Vault Tech? Saved humanity. No, there wasn't any profit in that, of course. <clears throat> Hello, who are watching? Thank you for watching. Retrieve the Goss Rifle prototype. Ooh, yes, please. When pigs fly, investigate the merchant workshop. <clears throat> Oh shit, that's a shotgun. <coughs> I'll stick with what I know. That works. <coughs> so many extra quests. that view anyway, but okay. <clears throat> I picked up a cigarette. Ew. Nasty habit. Don't advise. <clears throat> uh, yeah, I read that right.
Now when these quests stop piling up, I'm going to, uh... <clears throat> Malevolent malfunction. Ooh. Echoes of the past. Again. Ooh. Desk fan, thank you. What are you? Cram. I know you can cram that. <clears throat> Ammo. Ashtray. Hmm. Now, before you go, why is he grabbing all that shit? And the answer is, um... <clears throat> as opposed to the previous Fallout games, everything has a purpose in the sense of... You can make stuff out of stuff. I mean, make stuff out of stuff? I was intellectually stunted. Um, <clears throat> ah, there we go. There's the run button. Let's not go off the map. That's a bad way to, you know, end things. <clears throat> Although I'm technically in the easiest part of the world. Because it really suck if, you know, a Deathclaw ran up to you and chomped your nuts off as you're just like, I'm still learning how to move. <laughs> no, 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 I'm dead. <clears throat> That water looks, well, it looks like water. Oh, I had three viewers for a minute. Now I have two. Well, that's okay. Hi. I don't remember this bridge. Is this bridge of importance? <clears throat> Silt beans. Those sound delicious. Oh, this is how I walk, went ran up here. Okay, this is this was the this was the up. And I looted all the crap. And through the river to grandmother's house we go. <clears throat> Let's improve my ability to actually aim or handle a weapon. <clears throat> a new jumpsuit? What's the difference between a new... backpack. Lovely. Eyeglasses? Sure, why not? Um, no, we'll put that back on. live here. <clears throat> no 
there's old what's his name, you know, down the street. And old who the hell over here. Codsworth? As I live and breathe. Holy shit, Codsworth. Oh. Hey, buddy. <clears throat> God's what? What happened to the world? Uh, well, sir. <clears throat> well, my dark geranium still being the envy of Sanctuary Hills. <clears throat> I'm afraid things have been dreadfully dull around here. Things will be so much more exciting with you and Mrs. Back. Where is your bed? Um they came into the vault. Maybe you saw them armed, wearing strange outfits. Mm. Only Miss Rosie boy <coughs> around in his Halloween costume. Over a week early. I swear the nerve of that woman leaving her brat unsupervised. Codsworth. <laughs> Not like this family, sir. You and the missus have always been such Dude, she's... She's... in a better place. Sir, these things you're saying, these terrible things, I, I believe you have been <clears throat> Yes, a distraction to calm this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers, or perhaps charades. Sean does so love that game. <laughs> No, he's not. Codsworth, listen to me carefully. Have you seen him? Have you seen Sean? Why, the, the missus had him last, remember? <clears throat> she's gone to the Barker residence to arrange a play date. Dude. I'm sure she'll be back with him momentarily. Sean's been kidnapped. But I'm going to find him. I'm going to get my son back. Yeah, it doesn't really look like me. <clears throat> suffering from hunger induced paranoia. Not eating properly for two hundred years will do that, I'm afraid. Wait, what? Two hundred years? What? Are you? A, a bit over two hundred and ten. <clears throat> Codsworth? The hell, dude? Codsworth, you're acting a little bit weird. What's wrong? I. I. Oh, sir, it's been just horrible. <clears throat> Two centuries with no one to talk to, no one to serve. I spent the first ten years trying to keep the walls waxed, but nothing gets out. Stay with me, pal. Focus. I'm afraid I don't know anything, sir. The bombs came and all of you left in such a hurry. I don't want to give him a hug. He's been here alone for 200 years. Dead. I mean, I know it's just a floating eyeball, floating ball with eyeballs. Mosquitoes? Alright. Lead 
the way. The hell's a mosquito? <clears throat> oh, sorry. I am so sorry, Codsworth. Beating the crap out of stuff without me, buddy? Yuck. Bad. A safe? That's it. Hell yeah, I could pick locks. I don't know if I have any more lock picks now, but I can pick locks. Alright, Codsworth, where'd you go? Hello, Avon calling. TV dinner tray. Ooh, another TV dinner tray. Sounds stupid, but those are vitally important. A stool. And a hat. I love a good hat. Nothing wrong with a good hat. So we're finding laundered loungewear. Hmm. Have I stolen somebody's filthy negligees? Boy, I hope so. Can I steal the light bulb? Nope. Cannot steal the light bulb. Damn it. <clears throat> Alright, Codsworth, you find anything good? Guns, ammo, uh, food. couple of spare nuclear warheads floating around. God, this used to be such a nice neighborhood. And then I moved in. Codsworth. Any tawdry secret? Oh. Mr. Kevin. What? What up, buddy? Codsworth. Mr. Kevin, but this is a young Sean. The arch here. Thanks for trying, Codsworth. You can't give up, sir. What about the city? <coughs> there is nearby, and well, the people there have only shot me a few times. There's still people alive in Concord? Yes, although they're a bit rough. You remember the way? Just across the southern footbridge out of the neighborhood and past the Red Rocket Station? I'm convinced you know, you're the host. Thank you, buddy. We should clean up a little bit, but it's okay if you don't want to. Yeah, this isn't really my house anyway. I'm just... No, it's not. Ooh, a lamp. A shadeless lamp, no less. Scandalous. Has no secrets to hide. Tisk tisk. A uh, safe. Damn it. 
That was too easy. I feel ashamed of myself. What the hell is all this crap doing here? I can start doing some real, some real work. Not yet. I don't want to get stuck in all that stuff when I'm trying to move the story forward. Yes. Yes. Move the story forward. The adventure must continue. You cannot be distracted by mere um, house building and settlement development and other stratagems. No, no, nay. We must move on. Keep the home fires burning, Goswell. That's the plan. I'm just gonna have to do some shooting, looting, and smashing my way. Hello? Avon calling. Bottle caps, eh? Cinder block? That's a terrible indoor decoration. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah, I know how to swing things. Cockroaches. I see you. Okay, yum yum deviled eggs. Mm. I might have to disagree with you on that. Just a little bit, not too much. All right. Let's see what other treasures you have inside this lovely about. Oh, an oil can. It's a weird place to put it. A first aid. Oh, let's look at my first aid situation. All right. board and a t-shirt. Mm. I'm living on easy street now. Avon hey, calling.
Anybody missing an overwhelming desire to live? My computer. Let's see if I can infiltrate the network. And go onto the dark web and look up secrets. Reveal your secrets to me, computer. That was useless. You will reveal all. You will tell all. I will unlock all of your vital information. Sanctuary Hills. De Pietro. Totally high strung and needs to relax. I keep telling him that. I'm free to help, but so far, no dice. By the looks of the guy, he's self medicating with pie. Rude. Baker. My favorite tinfoil hat wearing nut job. Good for seven ampules of day tripper a week. Damn. Guess he's a one a day kind of guy. Whatever helps the man groove. Rosa. Still trying to get a feel, still trying to get her some buff out. Didn't expect the rashing to affect this, but it is what it is. He's a drug dealer. Jahani. He wants something called Psycho. I'm not sure the stuff even exists, and if it does, do I really want this Neanderthal using it? Guess it depends on how much he's willing to spend. I'll put some feelers out to my army connection, see where that goes. Guy wants combat stims. Russell. They still owe me for that last Excel delivery. Occurred to me. Was it even for them? Because so help me God, if I find out they're juicing up those dogs, we're going to have words about more than the money. But we've probably, we're probably beyond words anyway. I know they have a floor safe in there. I've seen it. Master bedroom, under the dresser. Can't be that tough to crack. O'Keefe. This is in Concord. Still good for a couple of hits of daddy-o a week. Pretentious, pseudo-intellectual asshole, but his money's good. All right. Williams. Wants MedX, as much as I can get. Hasn't told me why. Not really my business. Guessing there's some sort of long-term pain management going on. Disease? Anders. Kids are usually a no-go. This girl's got style. She's not interested in getting tweaked. Order 20 blood packs. Some Halloween stunt or something. Or hell, maybe she's really a vampire. What, what do I care? She's got her daddy's money. This guy's got some real questionable judgment calls. In Boston, Isaacs. Some student at CIT wants day tripper XL an entire pallet, yes, pallet, of Mentats. <coughs> Not sure if he's using, doing crazy experiments, dealing to the other eggheads, or on the verge of a nervous breakdown. Don't care so long as he, so long as the money's good. <sighs> Ward. Young married couple, good for a couple day tripper per week. Easy order, cool people, no brainer. McDermott. Cop. Long-time buff-out customer. Running into supply problems. We've had a good thing for years. I hate to end it now, and I don't exactly want to risk him getting all noble and law-abiding if he can't get what he wants. That would end very badly for me. Of course it is what is your drug dealer. Sapolsky. The old lady has upped her daddy-o order. Weird, but profitable. Miscellaneous. Malcolm. Potential nude customer in Charleston. Wants Medex. Seems oddly desperate. Might be a cop trying too hard. Need to move slowly. DeShane. Underwear model from Braintree. Beautiful, intelligent, totally weird. All she's ever wanted is stim packs. Ten plus per week. My imagination continues to run wild. Okay, if she's asking for stim packs, you really don't want to know what she's doing. Ever. No, you don't. Got an ad that's threatening to start soon. <laughs> oh, damn it.
Excellent. More guns. More stuff. An itchy no Oh, I should have shaved. Ugh. I need to do that before I stream tomorrow. This shiz on my face has just got to go. It just, it, it's, it's lived past its usefulness. It, it just does, It makes me look less like I'm an adult and more like a hamster with the mange. I'm kind of done. All right, here we go. Next house. Really? Any more surprises coming out of there? I got it. Get out of the get out get out get out get out the stove. Hey. No free shots, asshole. Gah. Somebody left out a perfectly good can of dog food. Delish. I mean, disgust. No, it delicious. I'd be surprised what I eat if I'm hungry. I mean, I will never eat dog food. I, I, I must confess, I will never be that hungry. I will never allow myself to be that hungry. Um, or I'll just, you know, go to sleep. You don't expend energy as under energy. Your appetite, you know, doesn't need to be taken care of as severely, in theory. <clears throat> Roast. We're going to pretend I didn't do that. me, so of course I look like a dork. Um, level up! Okay, you know what? Let's start with a, a beef up. Um... I got. I also need to un slowly unlock perks and stuff on the way along the way because if I don't, I'm going to be kind of screwed. So this is going to be an interesting progression. I found grenades. This is going to be fun. Dead dog. And a tire. Damn. Going to Concord. Concord. Yes, Concord. Or Concord or whatever. They say Concord. I say Concord because I'm Lexington and Concord, which is the site of a old American Revolutionary battle because I say it funny because I'm weird or something. A dog! Hey, buddy! Hey, boy. What are you doing out here all by yourself? You lose your owner, buddy. Aww. 
Okay, then. Let's stick together. I got a friend! Hey. How you doing, buddy? Hey, boy. You know any tricks? Oh. I wish I had... What'd you find? Ooh. Good job, buddy. Good boy. Dog, how'd you open the door? Stop opening doors. What? Where? Where's next? Oh shit. Where's the last one? Yeah, I know. Gotta get that last one. Come out, huh, boy? Whoop. Good boy, dog meat. I wasn't done, though. Come on. I can make drugs? I can make drugs? Yay, I can make drugs. Cool. Well, dog, is there something else out here trying to kill me? Shush. Can't listen to music. It's against the rules. Toaster. All right, what secrets do you have, mister? Took some wrangling with the head office, but we finally got all the tools we need to machine our own parts. No more having to pay for Corvega factory parts the next time they change the spec on a damn fastener. Just take one we got and trim the excess down until it fits. Not bad. Rosa Restoration. That Rosa widow on Sanctuary Hills is restoring an old classic Corvega with her son. Nice woman, pretty. Kid seems like kind of a brat, but I guess that's the point of her doing this project with them. Anyway, she's been doing a hell of a job. I was amazed at how much her and the kid have been able to go down, able to do on their own. The only reason she even came to me is because that engine is out of her depth. I'm sure we can help her out. Oh, nice, not bad, guys. Safe storage. Jim, take care of these barrels before you leave tonight. Inspectors are coming first thing in the morning. Just hide them with the others. We'll figure out a long-term solution later. Hey, if nature's going to favor us with a cave right below the shop, who might argue? What? Replace the brakes in a 
20 for 75, Fusion Flea Supreme. Monthly service on the vault Tech van. No major issues with the vehicle, but that rep is an uppity asshole. Began work on a late model motorcycle, pre-atomic. Seemed to simply be a sticky throttle, turned out to be a more serious issue with the cables. They're almost completely degraded. Replaced with platinum parts. Damn. Coolant leak in one of those new 2077 Corvette coupes. Bubble top. They don't make them like they used to. Replace the automatic alternator in a 2073 Corvega. And then the world blew up. Oh, wait. Coolant schematics? What? Oh, yeah, there's a cave back here. Dude, buddy, relax. I'm a professional idiot. Dog meat, calm down. We're a team, you gotta work with me, buddy, remember? Stupid blowing shrooms, let's see if I can grab it. No, there are no more, okay. Hey, don't yeah, don't whine. Besides. Good job, buddy. See? Teamwork. Well, this place is interesting. And by interesting, I mean disgusting. Mr. Benson, on behalf of Bo the Boston Regional Office, I'd like to congratulate you and your team on winning the 2076 Trash Busters Award for the greatest year-to-year -year waste reduction by a single store. Respect for the environment is an integral part of our corporate image, and we appreciate your innovative efforts in this regard. Sincerely, Gerard Phillips, Vice President, Boston Region. What? He's just burying shit in a hole in the ground. Let's get out of here before I grow a third nipple. the way that's shimmering. You hear that too, boy? Radiated down here. Whoops. I should probably leave. 
soon. Ooh, a safe. Yay! All right, now we'll leave. Let's get out of here, buddy. Wait, what? Bones? Yuck. I mean, possibly useful. A Nuka Cola? Alright, dog meat, we're gonna go back to Sanctuary Hills. And I'm gonna drop stuff off. And then we're gonna move forward. Some adventures. You and me. A pal and a pal. It's looking a bit weird out here. Well, there was all the glowing fungus. Let's go back to Sanctuary Hills. Watch my camera act up. Some of these games are just too pretty for me to use my camera, and it's a little annoying. Just a little bit. crash no it did not all right all right all right look at us we're being team team us doing us team stuff Godsworth, still over here being, uh, you know, miserable. Okay. And yeah, once I figure out where I'm going to actually live, I'm going to build a doghouse. And dog meat's going to stay there. Because he's safer that way. Some good eating. And a postman hat. So look, if you see better armor or better equipment laying around, you let me know. Because right now, the best armor in the world is actually my vault suit. Oops. That could have been a bad fall into some yucky looking water. So normally I set up shop here because there's a free uh, uh, witch magicker in there for power armor, but um, I might not. Also, those are the prices for cool. Uh, I'm assuming for gas because you know nuclear cars don't really need gas as much as they need coolant to keep the reactor from exploding. But 113 dollars a gallon. Holy crap! Uh-oh. Gross!
dumb bug. Serves you right. I wasn't even about to start trouble with you. You ran away. Dog meat. Come here, buddy. Oh, you came back for more, huh? And then you left again. Well, screw you. What? What? You're such a goofball. Stay here. Stay. <sighs> of course, you're being a goofball. You're a dog. Silly boy. Although you were motion captured by a very sweet girl. Ooh, cram. Cram, 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 cram. Instamesh. Unite the inner suppositories. What? Cram, 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 cram. That's not a door. Cram, 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 cram. What? It's a stop sign. It's a stop. Look, I get it. Can you calm down? We gotta do this. If we're gonna do this, we gotta do this together, like a team. See? Team. T E E M. Team. <clears throat> My camera is just screwed. I have to turn the damn thing off. I hate that. I actually have to look at the recorded footage and she 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 fish she fish worth of shit. Excuse me. a baby rattle. I'm going to ignore what that possibly portends because I don't want to think about it. Ever again. Yeah, that's where I just was. Come on, boy. Let's go. I know, I know, I know, you're upset. Don't think I can pick this. I can't pick the lock. Not yet, anyway. That's just next to the top of the building. All right, well. What? Of course I'm being reckless and stupid. My job! <laughs> That's a weird... I figure out what the hell's going on with my stupid camera. Either turn it off entirely or just... Come on, load up. Okay, cool. So I'm gonna pause right here. I'm gonna save the game. And I'm gonna say, 
probably won't see me too well on camera. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like this video, click the thumbs up button, subscribe, and ring the bell for the latest and greatest about We Play Badly. For notifications about the latest and greatest from We Play Badly. Subscribing lets you see all the content. Liking the, th the thumbs up button lets me know you like the content. Don't forget to let me know what you also think in the comments, because I can only improve my craft with your help and slapping my camera around. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye, everyone.